I'm Neha, um, I'm doing maths at Keeble and, and I'm first year. Hi, I'm John, I'm a third year studying maths at Keeble. Um, I went to a non-selective state school before coming here and I've really, really enjoyed my time here so far. Um, I, in my spare time, I love playing music and listening to music and getting involved with the Christian Union. So basically, I had three interviews in total. I had two at Keeble because that was the universe, that was the college that I applied to, um, and I had one at a different college. Um, that's the case for most uh, math students. For math interviews, everyone is guaranteed two interviews at the college, normally the college they apply for, but certainly one college, and another interview at a secondary college. And then you might have extra ones. People they might call you back and they might um, kind of want to want to see you again. It might be the same colleges or different colleges. And basically, if that happens to you, I wouldn't stress too much about it because um, it can mean a lot of things. But just treat it as um, a way to, this is an opportunity to show them what you've got. Basically, every college, there's no work to do before an interview. You basically just go in and answer the questions on your feet. Every interview that I had had about two interviewers um, interviewing me, and they just generally answered some math questions that I don't have. So normally there's two interviewers um, and there'll be one kind of leading the interview, asking the questions and giving you hints if you need them. And then another one will probably be kind of more focused on taking notes. Um, so in preparation, I basically just tried doing some problem solving type of questions and I tried doing maths with a friend or like do maths whilst a friend was watching me. And that got me used to um, like people watching me whilst I do maths, which can be quite intimidating at some so I had a couple of practice interviews with a teacher from my school um, and I practiced a few interview style questions by myself. Um, if you don't have access to someone that can give you a practice interview, I'd really recommend just practicing questions by yourself and talking out loud while you do it is really, really helpful um, and makes it's important that you, you're able to vocalise your thought process in an interview. Um, there's, about, there's a list of about 100 uh, interview style questions somewhere in the student room, which really, really helped me, so I'd recommend that massively. So the interviews were a lot less nerve-wracking than I thought they'd be. Um, they were only about 20 minutes long, and honestly, they go by so quickly. Uh, they just, there wasn't really much chit-chat. That I thought there'd be quite like, inter uh, like quite a, like, a lot of questions that they'd ask me, like about my personal statements, about things I did. But they really didn't ask me anything like that. They just wanted to do some maths with me. So overall, I found the interview experience um, stressful, but really rewarding too. Um, so I, I think from the first one, I was especially nervous. But for the other two, I was able to kind of um, relax a little bit and just enjoy the fact that I was solving problems with um, two like world-class mathematicians. Um, so that was a good, a good experience. Uh, I mean, even even one that I thought went pretty badly overall, um, still one of the questions that I was solving. Um, I still tell people today because it's, it's just a really fun problem. So I expected there to be a lot more like like question answer and there'd be a lot of questions about what I'd done in the past and things about my personal statement that would be brought up but it, there was really none of that they just wanted to sit down do some maths with me see how I approached a question and see how I responded to him and that was about it. So I was expecting uh, the interview to be kind of a me versus them kind of vibe um, well that was really just not true um, the tutors are kind of helping me through solving the question and like they're not counting giving hints against me but trying to see how I and how you think um, based off of these hints. Um, also, I was expecting the tutors to be kind of like antisocial maths robots, but they, they actually were really, really nice and they understood kind of how nervous I was feeling and helped to calm me down.